Welcome back on this Tuesday morning. We're starting off with overcast skies at 61 degrees in downtown Marquette. There's the view there. In Marquette, we're looking at mainly a mostly cloudy day for us. We're in the green, so that's a green good to go for today. No major concerns in Marquette, but areas across the west and along the Wisconsin state line, that's where those thunderstorms will be at. What we'll notice as you're stepping out the door this morning is that it's more comfortable as compared to yesterday morning. That humidity is now over the lower peninsula and mainly east of us as that cold front continues to track out of the region. But you can see dew point temperatures in the upper 50s and to the mid 50s as some slightly drier air moves in. It's still a little moist, but you notice the difference as compared to yesterday. This is the secondary front. It's just to our north and it will die from north to south today. It'll be uh, the spark for a few more thunderstorms later on. At this moment, a few isolated rain showers in the western counties extending even in parts of Bear Gun into Iron Counties at this moment. Here's your hour by hour for today. Here's midday. We're still mostly cloudy and fairly quiet at that point in time. Later on in the afternoon, as that front dives on south, we'll have some thunderstorms develop to the west and along the Wisconsin state line, extending through the evening hours. This will even impact potentially parts of Dickinson and Menominee counties later on in the evening. This is 930 tonight, so it will not be widespread. Most of these thunderstorms will mainly be of more impact for northern Wisconsin. High pressure moves in tomorrow, extending through Thursday, so look for sunny skies during that time period and dry conditions. Temperatures today, you can see that north and south split with 70s in the southern sections of the UP, upper 50s and even to the low 70s in the northern counties to near Lake Superior. Looking ahead, 70s for the bulk of the next couple of days, a little bit warmer and humid as we head into the weekend with more potential for scattered showers and some thunder showers into the weekend. And then tomorrow we have the full moon. It's uh, happening at about 2, 2 in the afternoon or about 2.38 in the afternoon. It's also uh, the, a super full moon. It's also known as the buck moon. Uh, and since it reaches peak illumination early in the afternoon, it'll still be visible after sunset here in the UP. We have more sports coming your way. Up next, 